everyone, Miss Stella here. So for this video, it's going to be the introduction part two. Um, so I've just been questing this whole time playing this game to try and get um, through all my quests and unlock a bunch of stuff. And I have. I've unlocked a bunch of stuff, but now I have no idea what I'm supposed to do. So I do have some money here with me who's going to kind of guide me through it. Um, do you want, oh no, what did I just click? I clicked something. Oh no, stop running. Get out, get out. Okay. All right. There, we're good. We're okay. Um, let me see. What? Oh. Oh, poor pet. Okay, there you go. I did it. Um, they're level 10. Do I have something that I need to do for once they reach 10? Okay, so they just stay at like this. How do you get to tier two? Oh no, so I have to buy more pets? My penguin is falling apart. Oh, he just keeps falling. Okay, so let's go to my camp because I did a bunch of stuff, but I don't know if I'm doing it right. Um, now, how do I zoom out now? Is it this one? Yes, okay. So, I did all of this. See, look, I even have a garden now. Um, does it matter what I plant? No. Oh. So, do I, which one should I keep doing tomato? Uh-huh. Okay. Oh, let's... Okay. But... So I've done all of these. Okay. All right, so just keep, oh, I have to fish. I did fish one, one time. I don't remember what I caught, but I did it. Yeah, so are there specific things that I should be crafting on here? Because so I've unlocked all of these forge weapon, but Okay, so Wait, what is this one? Oh. Okay, when I get orange stuff, then I'll tell you. Alright, um, so I've got this alchemy one. Is there, like, I don't know what this means. Like, should I be crafting any of these? Like, how? Oh, okay, so I need 75. Okay, what about? Oh, I have to, I need the stone. Oh, hold on. All right, there you go. Is that better? It should be. Oh yeah, let me make it louder. There. <laughs> Someone goes. No, focus in L two R. I I've been so busy. I've, <laughs> I've been so. Okay, I had the live stream this morning for L two R, and then I'm gonna have another one later on for global. So. Trust me, it's not. It's never gonna end. 
So, alright, so I get to retrieve all of these. And when it says complete, so I just do this. Just do complete all on the bottom, right? And then, what are these? What What's the coffee icon thing? That just means they're like in the inn or something. I don't honestly know what that means exactly. It's nothing. Okay. Like... Alright, so now, oh, I can... Wait, what? What I do? What battle is happening? Something. Oh, I can promote him. Ha! I promoted him. He got promoted. All right. So here's the next question that I've got. What's it? Um, gather. Is there specific that I need to do? Oh, corn. One of my worker can be. Oh, there you go. There's I nothing can... wrong with promoting. What are you talking about? The career? Oh, I don't know. She's limited on how many she can hire right now, anyway. No, it says gather. So, am I not supposed to promote it? With this promotion. I mean, do? you can just save them for now because when you increase your camp, you have to hire more workers. So you want to make sure you have enough to have max workers oh. before you start promoting. But I mean, you can get contribution more over time. Oops. It's not a big deal. You can always fire them if you need more. So how do I do the gather part? Do I just... So the best way is world gathering because it yields more, oh, but it okay. takes longer. And then you just choose which one you want. Okay, but hold on. Let me just check what items I actually need. Well, it shows you when you're in there what you are what you have. Oh, does it? Yeah, that's what those numbers were on the left side. Yeah, so wild grass, you have 1240. I need these. So on and so forth. These are the ones I need. Okay, we'll do this one. So it's five at a time. I have ten. Does it have to be? Does it just... I usually oh. just auto-select. It doesn't really matter. But depends on how many you want. You can only send five of each type. Yeah. Alright. One is being lazy. Yeah, we'll deal with him in a second. What? Oh, you little... Wow. Alright. It's then you should focus on getting purple and gold workers. Okay. I don't know what that yeah. means yet. Okay. It's just the tiers of workers. Same as the gear. Like, the, you know, they're white, green, purple, yellow, whatever. Alright, I think I'm done with the camp stuff now. Okay. Well, you, don't you have a bunch of stuff in your storage you weren't sure about opening or not? Um... My bag does. Oh, well then your bag, yeah. I have to open all the chests, like all of these. I haven't opened. Okay, I'm opening all of them. Oh god! Am I gonna have enough backspace? Oh, it's still going. Oh crap. <laughs> What's happening? You're opening all the chests that you have. It's fine. Oh! There's a lot of, like, crystals! Yeah. I've been combining them. I think that's what I'm supposed to do. Oh, I got an upgrade! Nice. Equip those purple ones. Nice. I got two purples. And I don't know what all this so far. Okay, let's start clicking stuff. <laughs> Hooray! I don't think you opened all your chests, but... Um, really? Yeah, I think there's more stuff you could open. Oh, crap. Okay. Alright, so let's go with Black Spirit. And let's do this far, this one first, right? Okay, how do I get rid of this one right here with the plus one next to it? 
Do I just hit absorb energy on all of these? Yeah. Okay. Auto select. Oh, these are um, unique. You can't get rid of the plus one because it's enhanced, so I don't know if you have it in your camp or not. There's an extractor. You have to extract it first, and then you can get rid of it. Okay. What about these? Do I add this in too? Um, on the auto select options, on the bottom it says condensed dark energy. Oh, okay. Like that, yeah. and then it'll auto absorb those when you hit auto select. Okay, I got it. And then just absorb it. So, do I throw this in too? Um, Except some of the blues might sell. You can post them. Okay. Because there's like a collection or whatever, or you can check it yourself and see if you need them for the collection. But... Oh, that's right. So the collection thing. All right, there you go. So oh, yeah, it doesn't look go. like you need them for the collection. You can just sell. Do I just auto? Oh wait, yeah, just auto register. Okay, so I just hit auto register everything first. Yeah, that's fine. So what does this mean? Does it actually take any of the materials that I registered? Yes. Oh, okay. It takes them, but most of them aren't really stuff that you'll need. Um, but it gives you stats and things too, like attack, defense, other things. It oh, gives so you it stole, resources. But it stole a lot of my stuff. Mm, I mean, yeah, but most of that you get pretty easily. And it also gives you things. See, you just got more energy. Click on the other ones. Why? Oh, it just does it individually. Okay, that's cool. Yay. You always want to check that before you feed, like, because there's a lot of oh, uh, blue and green equipment right. before you feed your spirit. Just check that. Okay. I forgot the collection. All right. So do collection, then the black spirit. Got it. Yeah. All right. So here, do I have, I think, this one? No. Mm, so do the autofill on the left side. And then fuse. Oh. Go back to the other thing first, the shop. Oh no. Where? Um, this one? Just exit back out of that. Or you can hit the get list on this one. So on the left side it has like the thing, yeah, just do autofill because you have a bunch of fragments to create more light stones. Oh! I'm making more! Mm-hmm. Oh, look, there's purple ones. Ta-da! <laughs> Lots of purple ones, wow. Yes! Okay, now I gotta equip them. Confirm? What? No. Equip. No, just hit cancel. Just exit it. Yay! I got so more stuff. So then you can go through. So don't... Um, yeah, do the first one. That one's good. Because it has def and it's a higher percent. Okay, so equip... Do I extract the other one first? Right? Just delete it. Delete it? Okay. Yeah, and blue's not that great. And you don't want to use the pearls on it. Okay. Next. Oh my god, that's awesome. Look at that. Delete. And then equip. And. What's a Le Brief damage? Or. Does that mean? This one. Um, I do the other one for you. Wait, go back to this one. Okay. Click on the one. So in on the left side, click on the bottom right, one. like the little circle that you have. Yeah. And it'll show the stats of it. Oh. Okay. Um. Um. Oh. I would just keep that one for now, just because it has a higher percentage. Okay. All right, it's done. So then you can fuse those. Um, no. Ah, there you go. I got another blue. Auto fuse now rare. Oh, I got a new purple! Nice. Two new purples. <laughs> Wait, does normal... Do I have any normal? No. See if you can equip any of those if they're upgrades first before you try and okay. fuse. Okay. 
Yeah, the one is the bottom left one. Um, should I do the inventory one? I like the inventory one. Yeah, it's higher percent anyway, so inventory is always yeah. nice right now. Perfect. I did it. So if you go back into the shop where you were before, uh huh, you can also do the same thing for relic fragments. So just go down one tab on the right side. Fragment. Light uh, relic. Relic. Autofill. Yeah, that's fine. And hopefully, I'll get a decent one. What is this? This is just like another thing you can equip. Okay, so you just got blue, so go into your inventory. Main relic? No. And I'm just in the top right, there's a bag icon. You can just go into your inventory. And... And then it's in the accessories tab, I think. The ring. <gasps> there's stuff here. What is this? So, generally the best one is usually... A mix of defense and AP, so see if you got one of those on the shirt. Attack, defense, attack, and defense. Okay, so it looks like it's the ring looking ones. Yeah. Um, a hib, a hib, what's the top one for the damage? 13. I mean, like the thing on the bottom, sir. So, okay, so I would do one of the bottom ones. Okay. And then just equip? Mm-hmm. Oh! And you can put alchemy snow. Okay. What? What is this? Oh, because of my costume. Oh, but I need the, f the face mask one. Those don't give CP. It's fine. I know, but ha I need the head yeah, one. Yeah, pearl inventory. You might already have them. Go to your pearl inventory in the top. Uh, no, you don't have any. What are these? It's camp contract for the camp manager. Okay, so do I use them? Um, You could use one of them. I don't know if they'd override each other because they're different ones. Okay, I'll use one. Oh, she wears a, she's wearing a French maid outfit. <laughs> I'm just saying. Okay. So now, oh wait, no, let's go see if I have anything else to open. Open. Oh yeah, there is. Okay. There's more stuff. Mm -hmm. Wait, what is that? What is what? This. Tier one pet chest. You got another pet. <gasps> you got the black cat. So now, if you don't want it, you can actually combine and potentially try and get a tier two. So I just I just do use. Yeah. Kevin, oh. <laughs> I will call you. Juju. Alright, done. Wait, hold on. Pro inventory character. Okay, I think I, I got everything. So now let's do the stones. So this one's, I can just do auto fuse right for the magic yeah one? okay you can do all of them yeah that's fine holy crap and i have three million silver it's pretty decent do i do rare too no you don't have enough it takes oh, three of each anymore. It stole all of them? Yeah, no blues, unfortunate. Make sure you do, yeah, you do your Black Spirit quests every day. 
Yeah, I completed three. I complete three of them on daily. All right, mm -hmm. I think I'm good. Okay, so you can enhance and probably feed your back black spirits. Oh, this one. It's almost 20. Yay! All right, so I got to get these to 20 next. All right, I'll do that later. And then here, let's do this. All right, we're done. Try going to your camp and see if you have the extractor. I'm not sure if you are high enough for that. Okay, hold on. Yeah, and the, uh, that path thing is uh, always good, too, to see what you should work on to get rewards. There are pretty decent rewards in there. Which one? The path to power thing you were just in. What is this? So you can select, um... Basically, she'll auto harvest and plant things for you. I have a new slave. Ah! <laughs> and then she'll gather like Dude, your. That uh, is awesome. She'll gather your pets and things like that. Your stones when they're ready. Whenever you go to camp. Nice. Okay. You so... just have to send out your workers and things. Sorry, I'm. Where am I going? So go to build. Oh, build. I'm not sure if you have an extractor yet or not. Oh, I can. I can make one. Yeah, you should make one. Okay, so the next thing we gotta do here is... Do you have stamina? Yeah, you should just oh. auto-complete the extractor. Okay. Then... Oh, this so is where then... I extract... Yeah, so you'll go uh... to extract black stones and then put the thing on. Extract here, yeah. Ta da! Okay, and this one. Oh. And then you can feed that to your black spirit. Now. Yeah. Perfect. Alright, um, no, the other thing I wanted to learn here is the. Oh, I think you have an accessory too you can disassemble. Oh. The extractor. The blue one that you I enhanced. need to upgrade it first. Ah, oh, okay. Yeah. Basically, for that, it'll just give you two of that one at base level. Or however many enhanced levels it has. Alright, but here's the next one that's really, really confusing. Okay. Um. No. Where is that new thing? Which new thing? Node? Oh, this. Like. Oh, all in the. You have to assign workers to it. Um, I wouldn't personally worry about that until your camp is higher. Oh, okay. So I need to hire. Can do it? No, 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 no. We can do that later. Because it was really, really confusing. I was just, like, kind of all over the place with it. When I saw it, I was like. What is happening? There's so much stuff in there. It's really scary. Don't go in there. Um, you want to do a runes run real quick? Yes. Sure. So at the top of your screen, there's like a little arrow, a uh, white arrow or whatever. If you click that, it'll like open your resources. Not in any menus when you're just on the main thing. There's it's at the very top in the middle, like a little black bar with a white down arrow. Huh? <laughs> Move your mouse to the left, in the middle oh. above that little announcement thing. No. Directly in the middle of your screen at the very top. Oh, these. Oh no, this one. Oh, at this top, one. Silly. Yes. There you go. <laughs> so that shows you resource or what you kind of resource you have, and then if you click resources, it also shows like your gathering. Okay, so what I need and all that stuff, so whenever I need. Yeah. So in the wealth tab, it shows you like your tablets or runes, your gold coins, things like. That. Okay. 
Wait, let me go to the shop. I want the the headpiece for my <gasps> Oh that was awesome Oh but this is the matching one for my <gasps> Can I buy these? I mean you can, it's up to you. I wouldn't but Oh No. Ah, uh, but. Oh my god, that is adorable! Okay, wait, I'll do this later. I'll, I'll <laughs> play around with this. Um, okay, I'm sorry, what are we doing now? I'm gonna invite you to a ruined friend. Okay. By the way, I tried. The arena ramenous thing. Mm -hmm. I got my butt kicked a lot. <laughs> okay, so here, here, wait, wait. Do I just like how? Oh, so do I always just pick? So this? yeah, the more you you do it, the higher you can unlock. You know how many multiple? Okay. Um, the max right now is twenty three, but each time you do it, it'll. You know, you can do it one higher. Okay. Alright, I am ready. Okay, I'm just trying to find a couple more people. I'm gonna get carried. Um, so if you go back out to the main area, all the way out of the menu. Uh-huh. In the top right, there's like a little party thing. Just hit ready. And I'll enter this one. Done. I gotta hide. Vala's gonna come for me. You're good. She can't kill you. The only way people can kill you if you don't have Alvon mode on is if you're at war, but you're not even in the guild. I'll just enter us. It's probably gonna be rough, but it's okay. And then auto. And I'm gonna die. Very Oh, that's the other thing. I need to work on my skills. Um, because I don't know what I'm supposed to be working on. You pretty much just throw skill books in them and they level There's not much to them besides when you level up you can choose like certain attributes but well i meant like are there oh, which ones to use yeah combinations that are better for this class like to kind of use together like i like the healing one because i've noticed that majority of the mobs that i'm trying to kill now for quest actually um are hurting me so yeah that'll get better once you can equip your yellows. I have I kind of played around with the skills so I I'm testing some of them out. I'm not I'm just not sure if there's a specific one that I should be using for like the combo. Um yeah, I can show you when you go into the skill list there's like a combos thing. It doesn't I don't know if it makes them do more damage, but it makes them like cast faster or stuff like that. Oh, okay. Sure. Perfect. I'm getting killed non-stop. Yeah. This is a lot higher than you guys are. <laughs> I want to try to do this though so I can get you the uh, alchemy stuff so you can see how the... Okay. Okay, now we gotta go here. So a tip for this guy also... 
Um, when his HP bar gets to times three, or when it's about to go to times two, he'll do like this big AOE pulse, and then if you dodge, you won't get hit by it. Okay. The best way for a witch, at least before you ascend, is just to do the Thunderbolt spell, because it gives you immunity for it. That's cheating. I was attacking this ancient amplifier for, like, ever, and it, and, like, you guys come in here and just one-shot it. Like, that, that's not <laughs> even funny. Then I'm dead again. I don't even know what killed me at this point. I mean, anything hitting you in here will probably kill I know, but there's this like... giant guy on the right side that's like a... Oh, he, it's like a shadow of him, but... Oh, it's a replica. Yeah, there's just different phases. So you, like, kill him until he loses, like, five HP bars, and then he summons it. You gotta kill him. And then you do that oh, again one more time, and then the guy. last phase, oh. there's, like, two copies. Nope. It gets stronger. Yeah, you're telling me, dude. Alright, I'll help kill these things so you guys don't have to keep fighting them. Actually, probably easier just to kill I'm kind the of boss. hurting him. I mean, I get him like a 16th down before I die. <laughs> one bar down. There, no, it'll probably take me two hours to get one bar down. Hold on. Let's see. Wait, tell me I'm the one doing this. Hit me. Oh, I can hurt the 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 mirror ones before they turn me. Yeah. You see at the top the HP bar for the big guy. Yeah. When it gets to, so once this bar gets down to the end, he's gonna do the big AOE pulse. So just try and dodge it. Yeah. Mhm. Mm like that. Oh. Oh. He's. He's going Godzilla on me. Hold on. Wait. I gotta run. Maybe I can hide here. It already went off. You're good. Okay. <laughs> I did it. See, I was listening. Sort of. I don't even know what that skill does. Oh, that's my... That's the storm thing. Oh, that's mean! This dude is so good, too. Sorry, he's almost dead. Yay! Yeah. I killed it. You did? Mm-hmm. I did all that work. That was all me. <laughs> You're welcome. Alright, so you should have enough to be able to craft one alchemy stone so you can go to your camp and see how that... Uh, go to camp, right? Mm-hmm. I can do some lower ones for you too later on to boost your max thing or whatever some other time. And for this one? Wait. Alchemy map. It's the alchemy one, okay. yeah. Craft. <gasps> Yay! Alchemy stone. Bam. Stone of Courage. Well, it's not a bad one. Could be better, but... So then you go into your inventory and you can equip that one. So there's different ones. The one I have is similar to yours, but it does minus HP. I can't then... equip it yet. It says I need... Oh, I need... The oh, you need Black Spirit. Yeah. So click the little magnifying glass next to that. Or it says requires Black Spirit 5. Complete more and main should tell quest. you what you need to do. No, just main quest. Okay. <sighs> I think that's the same for your yellow gear, so you should yeah. unlock it at the same time. So I guess I have uh, Which zone are you in, anyways? I'm 32.5% of North Ka Kalf. 
Oh, you're pretty close then. I think that's the zone. You need like I eight more percent. I cleared the, the one before this last night. Do you know how crazy that is? <laughs> Alright, so... Well, you're like a few quests away from unlocking it, so... I know, and then now I mean I have um, to keep going. In that teller shop, always buy the stuff for silver. Okay. So At least for now, anyways, because you'll use all of the. Okay. Got it. All right. So the next notification. Oh, for this one. Um. So I know you unlock a bunch of these, right, from questing or regions or whatever. Um. But how many? How often should I be doing this? Do I just clear through all my stamps? I mean, yeah. There's no time not to do them, really. Any and. Time do Otherwise, you end up in my situation where you have a ton to do and no time to clear. Okay, so for the difficulty, do I try to get the highest for every single one of them? You want to do the highest you can get up to. Okay. And then just, I mean, if you're getting rid of your tickets, you can just repeat. But to unlock the higher difficulty, you have to uh, beat that one and go to the next one. Yeah, and then it goes up and it goes up. But... Does it matter which boss I go to for for them? Or... Um, when you're doing that, also never use the Black Spirit or the Black Pearls exchange thing. Just do like the single pass exchange. Or yeah, pass. I've only used these. Okay, just making sure. Cause yeah. Some people do that. So. Oh, I've never clicked that because I didn't know what, what to use the Black Pearl for yet. That one basically just lets you choose which one you want to exchange it for, which you really don't need. Oh, so. okay. Um, so I'll all right, so I'll do these up, and I'll start just progressing to yeah. that. Yeah, they give you good wards, too, and then, like, um, certain bosses have knowledge that'll give you attack, defense, things like that. All right, so do you want to do this? Can I get use combat plus for boss rush mid? Oh. You already have combat plus, but it lets you do multipliers of runs or whatever. So instead of doing one at a time, you can do six, and then when your knowledge gets to ten, you can do six at a time. Oh, the knowledge thing. Okay. All right. So the next one is. Where did it shock? So it there is no um when you do this, do I just? It's just RNG. Oh, so there is a chance that I can get a yellow. Item too. You could get a red, but a small chance, but yeah. I have a purple weapon now, but it, I'm gonna end up with the yellow. I should just save up all of this and do like a massive one later, cause I'm gonna be working on unlocking for the yellow anyways. So I'll just save it for now. Yeah, I mean either way. Oh, and then this it. one. That's what we just did, yeah. Okay, so we we only do one at a time. One. Time. You can do as many as you want, as, as many tablets as you have. Okay. Alright, so the next one... Oh, that is a lot of skill point stuff. Yeah, you saw all of us. Holy crap. Because usually it's only like 10k or 6k or something like that whenever I do it. But today was... Yeah. Are you doing the Black Spirit mode farming? Oh, yeah. Or... So that, that's what we need to talk about um when i afk it usually just oh shit what did i just do i don't know what i just did um usually like when i afk it goes to the black spirit mode right but what if i want to go to the black spirit mode before i afk just so it just goes black screen so how do mm -hmm. i do that Black spirit mode is just like offline mode. It's just wherever you are, it just puts you offline. Can there. you do it manually to go there though? Like to go like, where? To go black spirit mode right away, as opposed to waiting until it does it on its own. What do you mean it doesn't do it on its own? You have to choose. Well, okay. So if I'm fighting, right? If I'm AFK fighting. Um, let's go to a mob area. Hold on. So, how I'm going to the Black Spirit mode now is when I'm auto attacking a group of mobs and then, um, I'll AFK for like 10 minutes or something 
and then when the sleep thing pops up. Yeah, the sleep. Oh, so, yeah. So, <laughs> yeah, you can do it manually. Yeah. But what I'm asking is, how? Oh, do I just go here? You just yeah, just and then on the very bottom. That's oh, great. okay. That's what I needed. I was kidding. I knew that. <laughs> I'm gonna edit that out of my video. Thank you. Mm -hmm. I knew that. Totally. Of course. All right, next one. Um, more stuff to my collection. All right, great. <gasps> that was a purple, I think. No, maybe. Yes. Hold on. Collect. Oh. Collect all of these. Oh, I actually get the nine nine by the end of the night now. I've been so good. Yeah, I mean, you should. You should try and finish all of those things. I it's a can. good uh, measure of you did everything for the day. I've been trying. Slowly. Just letting you know. Um, boss not Collect all rewards for boss knowledge? Yeah, that's fine. Okay. More skill books. Okay. Strengthen your gear. Yeah, I know. I'll do my enhanced later. That gets boring because it's... <laughs> That's a lot of CP you should probably focus on. Oh, yeah, I will. You don't have to do it on the stream, but... Yeah, I'll do that later. Um, oh, the last thing we gotta do before I end this stream mm -hmm. is you're gonna teach me how to tame a horse. Okay. So, first thing you have to do is go to a town, because you're going to need some stuff that you probably don't have. So, I saw a white horse, and then they tried to tame it, and they ran away. Yeah. You need the rope, you need some sugar cube. Okay, hold on. Let's go to town. So, do you know the easy way to go to town? Yeah, go to the map. Well, that's not the easy way, but it works. What? <laughs> that I'll was... show you something when you're in town. So once you get to town, um, so the icons next to the map, the four left ones, uh -huh. the one that looks like a house with an arrow on top of it. Yeah. If you click that, you can save locations, and then at the top to nearby town, it just teleports you to the nearest town. So that you can do like a farming spot that you like or something. You can save that location and then you can click go to and it'll auto run. And then if you're out in the field, you can just click the go to nearby town and it teleports you there instantly. I knew that. Mm -hmm. Okay, so what do I need? Horse taming rope I have. and sugar. I have the, the rope. I bought a bunch of them. Okay, well, you need sugar then. Like, five. Oh, five. No, let me make it ten. Let's do here. Okay, <laughs> ten. What about this one? What Which is... one? Oh, it's... I can name my... Okay, I've got I can't see because the code's covering it. Oh, yeah, you don't really need that, but you can. Yeah, of course. I gotta name all my horsies. You can name them when you first capture them. You don't need to... <laughs> I know, but what if I... I'll, I'll come up with... This one is just called Brown Horse. Like, wait, how do I change the name? Wait, no, go back. How do I... Hit the info and inventory. And you're next to the horse and the three things pop up. Um... Info and inventory. Oh, above the horse. It says bond. You're bonding. Yeah, the one to the right of that. That says info and inventory. No, it says... Oh! I knew that. Okay. So here, I can name it. Yes. We'll call it Brownie for now. Ha! Uh, I get to name everything. This is awesome. <laughs> Alright. While you're in town too, go to a vendor. Potion vendor doesn't... Okay. If you go to the potion one, actually, you have knowledge you can get from them. 
with a little book with the question mark on So just talk to them. Or that one. You got it. Okay. Wait, do I have to do something? This one? Generally, it's just talking to them, usually. Can I give... So then go to the... Can I can, yeah. give him the hanging bell gift? Mm-hmm. So then go to the shop and then just make sure you sell your junk. Ta da! Done. Okay, now you have more room in your inventory. So now ha we're gonna go tame a horse. Where do we find yep. a horsey? So if you open up your map and go to the different zones, there's an icon generally that says like a horse taming or something. What it is exactly, but um, monster knowledge. Now, if you just click on the zones, like each one individually, oh, fish names zone. of them. Oh. Yeah, so that one's a fishing oh, zone. Go. So, you gotta it. find the one that has a horse. Got one wild horse capture area, yep. and then on the map, there's a little horse looking icons you go near those and then try and find a horse that's hopefully there all right now let's go find a pretty horse why does my horse walk really really slow Because it's only a tier one. How do I make it run? Just does it by itself. Just oh, okay. move normally. <laughs> so we gotta find the horsey. Let me see. The easiest way I found to use the horse is just hold down forward and then just change the camera to. To hold forward higher. Hey. By using keyboard. Weird. Oh, you know what? To I know why. The, uh, yeah. yeah, that's why. Okay. Hold on. I'm going to fix this. Because this is going to be really bad. Yeah, expand it. It should be good. <laughs> when you face cam. Huh? Screening chat. Oh, he wants to. Ah, uh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, no. Save. Alright, this is better. So, how do, okay. do we just run around and look for. Yeah, you just go to the horse icons, and if there's a horse there, you can try and capture it. If not, okay. keep looking. Probably easy. <laughs> That's what I was saying, it's easier just to rotate the camera and hold forward. Oh. That's a mob. No. They're generally like right on top of the icons, so they're not super far from them. God, this is terrible on the p- Oh, there's one, there's one, there's one! Is that one? Yep, so hop off your horse. In the bottom right. Okay. And then you hit the tame thing. And then you want to slowly move into it. If he jumps on his back legs, don't get close to him. Okay. And then just walk up to him. Uh! Uh! So I just get closer to it? Yeah, just walk up to <laughs> Just don't keep walking to him <laughs> once, once he's not on his back leg. Oh, I tamed one? Tame horse? Not yet. Oh. Feed him sugar. See in the bottom it says chance 40 out of 80. No. 
And I cover it up keep by feeding it? Yeah, just keep feeding them until it's 80 out of 80. Oh, I see it. Okay, 60 out of... One more. No, two more! So when you hit tame, there's going to be a little mini game. You have to keep... It's like a oh vertical no, bar. Yeah, there's a vertical bar and you have to keep like the, oh, the little thing in between the lines or whatever. Oh, now what? Oh. No! <laughs> It happens, but that's just what you have to do for it. But how many sugars do I have? Six. Okay. Alright. I will tame a horse, people. I will get me one. <laughs> yeah. Me. Once you get the hang of it, it's not too bad. But... Okay. Let's see. Let's find my horsey. Why do you attack the mobs. Oh, it's just if you're running through and you do like a dash that does damage. Oh, okay. Oh, can I? No, I have to walk around this thing? Oh, it's down there. So that means... I have... Wait! Why are you stuck? Alright, there you go. So we gotta go back this way. Can you not auto attack mobs? You're locked on to stuff. Hit the little lock icon next to the fireball. Oh, that one. Okay. No, I don't want to attack you. Go away. Nope. No, that's annoying. This is better now. So I hold. Oh, there's one right here. There's one. There's one. I can see it. Okay. Get closer to the horse. Okay. Now let's feed it. Ninety percent. Okay. I have six left. So, no, four now. I'll get it. And one more. And then... Tame. Okay. So now... it down. There you go. I got it! Yay! <laughs> I got me Yay. a horsey. Congrats. Um. So, something with exchanging or upgrading tiers. You see why I pets? called it Christian? Because he's Dre. <laughs> <laughs> oh, goodness. <laughs> That's okay, my crow's name is Russell, so <laughs> Okay, I'm sorry. I'm done. Well okay, go ahead. I'll be um, with exchanging pets, uh the they just have to be the same tier, the level does not matter, but for horses for breeding, they have to be the same tier and they have to be level ten. Okay. So I have how do and I to do that you just have a stable in your camp. So how do I change my horsey? I have to go to your camp and do the stable. Okay. Con exchanging horses, continue. Okay. Confirm. Uh-huh. New. Breed. Oh, I don't need to do this stuff yet. Manage. Oh, they're both. 
So you can breed them. They're both uh, level ten. Level ten, yeah. You can skip the feeding thing. That's uh, just a camp manager feature. Basically, if you have a level ten horse out and you're in an area where you can, ex it stacks up XP and then you They're can pop up your baby. other horses. <laughs> They're gonna make a baby. Mm-hmm. So, do I just hit this appearance then? Yeah, you choose what it looks like and stuff like that, and then other things. Oh. Wow. Okay, I like this one. Oh, wait. But this one looks so cool, though. Okay, I like this one. <laughs> okay. <gasps> Just confirm it. And there you go. Wait. Now you have a tier 2 horse. So you see on the left side before you enter exit that it has like skills and a bond thing. Wow. Yes. So the bond buff is basically whenever you bond with the horse it gives you that and it can change depending on you know, just so random I just what you get. Feed till full, right? Yeah, click the little check mark that says feed until full. Okay, I did that. And then feed it. There, now it's level 10. Easy. Ta-da! So then you can go and capture more horses. And then the highest tier right now is tier 5, so... Nice. I got me a new horsey and his name is Blondie. <laughs> oh, her name is Blondie. Alright. I did so much today. This is so good. Aren't you proud of me? I've been doing so good at this game. Yep. I'm just, just got a little bit farther in the story, and then it should get way easier for you because you can wear the yellows. Yeah, I'll be able to wear my stuff. And um, next live stream though, so I get to see like all of these materials, but I want to kind of understand a lot of them. So I'll save a bunch more. Okay. And then it can open. Those trees in your uh, inventory, you can use those and you can place them in the can. <gasps> I open more stuff. Wait, what? If you go to your inventory. Uh-huh. And then the far right tab. Yeah. There's trees in there. <gasps> use the trees and then you can place them in your camp. Does it make it look pretty then? Of course. Where, how... So then you'll go to the little move icon in the bottom. Yeah. <gasps> and you can place things that way. This is like Minecraft 101. <laughs> Let's see yeah. That There's a limit on trees, but it's quite a lot. So if you visit my camp, you can see how many trees I have. You can get lost in my camp. Let's put you there. Do you know how to visit people's camps? No. Okay, well, when you're done Look placing that. Wait, one more. What is this one? It's like a giant heart thing! <gasps> it's like an archway. Yeah! Oh, you have a bunch of them? Yeah, you have five or something. Four now. <laughs> oh, nice. Hold on. Guys, the entrance. Oh, no. Wait. Let me fix you. Let me fix you up. Alright, let me. F <gasps> no, I'll do this later. I'll redecorate my entire camp and you guys can visit later on. But look, now he's got a bunch of hearts all over. <laughs> so the bottom left icon next to where your map would be, if you click that, you can visit your friend's camps. Um, bottom where your map is, top left. It's along with the person next to the camp. And then 
if you I visit can't visit mine. yours. <gasps> Ooh, you got lots of trees too. <gasps> this looks so much cleaner than mine. <laughs> A little bit. I haven't organized it too much, but Okay. See how many trees you can have though? I'm at the max, so I just keep swapping out for the cherry block. Okay, I, I gotta redo my entire camp. My camp is like a hot mess, like... Okay, I will make you proud. I will do my redo my entire camp and you'll be happy. Okay, well, don't first visit, thing is... Don't visit my camp, don't, don't, don't cheat. I won't. Wait, what am I doing now? Finish your story to unlock yellows, and then do your can. Okay. I'll do that first. I'll finish my quest, and then do my, um, equip my yellow, and transfer all of my enhancement. Thank you! Um, oh. alright, I'll start saving more stuff, more questions to go over for the next video. I think I did cover, like, almost everything I wasn't sure about so I'm really happy now because a lot of it makes sense to me thank you um all right so the other thing that's also something that I didn't mention is that um becoming a partner with Black Desert Mobile um, there's a creator partnership code, so if you do want to start playing... Did you want to go over skills real quick? Oh, yes, that's true. Oh, yeah, I don't know which ones I'm supposed to be using. So these are the ones I have... So I'm just going to remove all. Uh, okay. I mean, you can do that. I really like my arcane bolts because... So it depends on what you're doing. I use different sets, but if you're just farming, yeah, um, per you can use fireball, frigid fog. Uh-huh. So let's go through and list the ones I use. Um, you can keep arcane bolts on there. It's fine. Okay. It's whatever. If you really want it. <laughs> it's good for boss fights, too. Yeah. So do Arcane Bolts, Fireball, Frigid Fog, uh, Whirlwind. I'm just going in order of the list so you can just scroll through easily. Mm -hmm. uh, lightning Storm. I like the Lightning Storm. And then Frozen Orb. Thunderbolt. And then uh, Healing Aura. Because heal is always nice. And then the, I think it's called Lightning Chain. Oh. Those are the ones I use. Awesome. For just AFK farming or whatever. Oh, and then I can create one for boss kills, boss fights. Yeah, there's and three PvP. tabs. You can do one for, like, <gasps> boss things, and then you can do PvP, yeah. Awesome. Okay. Great. The only change I would make on that later on is when you unlock Meteor, I would replace Arcane Bolts. Oh, it does more damage. Meteor is, well, it's AoE, so it's better for farming. Oh, for farming. Okay, got it. It does a lot of damage at single target, too, but Bolts is really good. Okay, I'll make a farming one and a boss one. And then I'll, right after I do this, I'm going to do my keybinds properly so it does it actual it actually does what it's supposed to do instead of just me dragging my mouse and everything else um all right i am gonna end this video because i'm gonna go finish up this class and try to get unlock the yellow part but also you guys see that there's a code on my screen um as partner with um Black Desert Mobile Creator Partnership Code, I will also add it to the comment once this video is up, but for all the new players, it's 
going to be one of the new promos that, that that's going to be available for them. So if you're planning to play this game, please, please, please use my code. And yeah, that's it. Thanks, everyone.